Hi guys, I was sent some hair to review and I'm really excited about this hair and I definitely had to share it with you. See all of these hair reviews for different uh, Brazilian hair companies and there's a couple of differences about this particular one and that's why I was really excited to do the review. The company is called Private Stock Hair. Now um, they are a lot of the reviews that I've seen for Brazilian hair companies in the past they are international or overseas. Private Stock Hair is a US based company and uh, the owner is Angela who is a sister so yay sister owned business. Now she launched recently a specific line of hair that is catered towards us naturals and so I thought that was really exciting because typically you'll see Brazilian hair in straight wavy curly um, but she's she's gonna step above that and not only is she offering kinky hair um, but she's offering it in different textures so she's got this one here this one here is called the baby girl curl and as you can see I think that looks more like a, like a 4B type of curl very similar to my Lejay wig and you guys have seen me blend my Lejay wig with my own natural hair by doing twists in the front small twists just to sort of mimic that type of curl pattern she's got this one here which is called go natural and as you can see it's almost like um, more of a spiral curl so that looks almost like uh, I guess you could say 3C 4A maybe uh, that type of curl pattern this one is called fro natural and this one has no definite curl pattern so that is the one that I was sent and that is going to mimic my natural 4C texture the best and it comes packaged like this wrapped up in tissue paper and then just tucked into the fold in the front you've got her her business card privatestockhair.com and also her little pamphlet or care guide I was sent three bundles one bundle of 14 inch and two bundles of 16 inches it feels really soft So I'm really excited to get into this. This is just a first impression. I just got the goods. So so here I am a couple days later and I decided to make a U part wig with the hair I received. So I just want to show you my supplies. I've got my mannequin head. I picked up a mesh weaving cap and I've also got my weaving thread and weaving needle. Everything I picked up from my local beauty supply store. And of course, I've got my fro natural hair from Private Stock. I'm sewing the hair on to the mesh weaving cap and I'm sewing through the wefts on the corners and then sewing around the hair uh, for the length of the hair. And I decided to sew it instead of glue it down because I don't want to ruin the follow up review, but I actually really love this hair and I didn't want to ruin it. I definitely plan on reusing it. I definitely will be back with a review follow up of this hair, but I wanted to show you guys a little bit of my process just in case I got some questions about it. And I also want to let you know that Angela from Private Stock Hair was nice enough to offer a discount code for any of you who are interested. So I will put the information in the description box for that. Okay, so I've made great progress. This is sometime later, okay. Took a break, but here's all that's left out of the top. I've got both packs of 16 inch on the bottom I just had a little bit left and then on the top I started putting in the 14 inch and so far I've got that much left out I'm gonna do one more row I'm gonna do one more row right there and for the final row I'm actually gonna use some bonding glue because I think so I bonded the top row and allow the glue to harden just to sort of form a seal. And what I'm going to do is I'm just going to cut this excess mesh out of the middle. And I picked these up. If 
from my local beauty supply store. They're just uh, four of the little side combs, but really small versions. So I'm going to actually sew these into the wig. So I'm finally done making my wig, my U-part wig using the private stock hair in Fro Natural. And this is what she's looking like so far. Um, I did lightly separate the curls so you can see that once you separate it, it takes on this awesome afro texture. I'm going to go ahead and rock this wig out for the next week or so and come back and give you a more thorough review. But this is just the introduction and I want to... Um, yeah, let you guys know about it because I'm really excited about it so far. So, I'll be back. <laughs>